Then they that gladly received his word were baptized, and the same day there were added unto them about 3,000 souls. Baptism does not make someone a Christian. The decision to accept Jesus Christ does that. But baptism does give public testimony to the fact that someone has accepted Christ, and it identifies a new believer with their Savior. My name's Rosa, I'm 20 years old, and the first time I came to Lancaster Baptist Church, I would say I was like 16, and then I stopped coming, started going to other churches, and then just recently back in November, I came back with my brother. Uh, when my brother started coming, I saw that his life changed. I saw God do like a 360 in his life, and I just felt like I needed to come so I can do that too. Well, I grew up in a Christian home. Both of my parents have been saved, and they've always taught us that Jesus is the only way, and it's the way that I needed to be. So I thought at age 15 I was saved. I've always known it in my head. And then on March 23rd, um, I went to Brother Graham's house after um, the evening service, and we had fellowship there. And my friend Dana, um, we were talking about um, when, I, when was I saved, and how did I know? And I had a, I had a second guess, and I didn't want to have a second guess. I wanted to know in my heart, not just in my head, that Jesus Christ is my Savior. So on March 23rd was when I finally trusted God with all my heart and decided that He is my Savior. After I accepted Jesus Christ as my Savior, I was so happy. I was in tears. I felt like a weight was lifted off my shoulders and um, I just wanted to cry. I was so happy and um, I felt I've changed. I feel like I don't feel the need to have the same friends or same relationships. Um, God has shown me that once you've been saved, you'll always be saved. Um, doesn't mean that I'm going to be perfect and I'm not going to sin, but it's been a gift to me that's been given to me and it's not going to be taken away. God always has blessed me and given me um, just what I needed to keep on that narrow path, and I'm just so excited to see what He has in store for me. I'm excited to be baptized so that way I can take that extra step to live for God and, and do what He wants me to do. Rosa, based upon that public profession of accepting Jesus Christ as your Savior, it's my privilege to baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost, buried in the lightness of His death, raised in the lightness of His resurrection. Amen. Brother Guy, good job, sir.